You think Vegas has it all? Well, think again, because Henderson has an entire lifestyle and community that you don't realize you're missing out on. Here are five things you need to know about living in Henderson, Nevada, starting at number five. Okay, first let's get the logistics out of the way. Henderson is a city that is adjacent to Las Vegas, and it was established in April of 1963, whereas Las Vegas was established in May of 1905. Henderson is located in the southeast part of the valley and is complete with its own mayor, city hall, and downtown is complete with its very own convention center and courthouse. Okay, let's get into the nitty gritty about the five things you need to know about Henderson. So starting at number five, Henderson has been recognized as one of the top three in many categories across the United States. It has been recognized as one of the top three largest, safest cities to live in. It is one of the top cities to retire in. It's among the top cities with an active lifestyle, and it has a huge amount of small business owners who are satisfied with how their businesses are running in the city. The city of Henderson is not only recognized in all these categories, but generally is placed among the top three in all categories that they are recognized for. So number four, I don't think many people know this, but Las Vegas actually has a huge BMX community. Located just minutes from downtown Henderson is the Whitney Mesa BMX track, which is home to Olympic gold medalist Connor Fields. And it's also one of the top 30 tracks in the USA and Canada. It is a USA BMX sanctioned track. So before you go run over there to go ride your BMX bike, you must possess a valid USA BMX membership to ride. And Whitney Mesa isn't the only BMX track we have in Henderson. There are also two others available for all BMX riders of all different levels. Before I get to number three, in case you're new here, let me introduce myself. My name is Lisa Lopez and I was born and raised in Las Vegas. I'm a real estate consultant that specializes in luxury real estate. If you have any needs in the Las Vegas area or anywhere in the world for that matter, I can help you out please feel free to reach out anytime. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel to keep getting videos like this. Number three, the city of Henderson hosts an annual Winterfest where residents can come together to kick off the holiday spirit. And here they actually do the city's tree lighting as well. I can remember taking my kids way back when they were young. My kids would be running around with their friends waiting for the tree to be lit. This is a really magical and cool experience. So if you haven't checked it out, check it out. And if you do move into Henderson, make sure to go by because it is really a nice event to go to. It also, um, there's also a parade that features local marching bands, dance groups, and different entertainers that are locally curated with floats that are lit up with Christmas decorations as well. It's really cool to see. And number two, did you know Henderson has its very own chocolate factory? Unlike Willy Wonka's chocolate flowing river, FLM Chocolate Factory is appropriately surrounded by a cactus garden, which they magically transform into a dazzling holiday wonderland during Valentine's Day, Halloween, and Christmas. That is also something really spectacular to see and really cool to just walk through with your children or on a date night or on girls' night out. It's really an amazing experience. And it's also a nice experience to see a lot of the native Mojave Desert plants when it's daylight and not necessarily a holiday. So if you haven't seen the Cactus Garden, go check it out. Um, they also have the Chocolate Factory where you can um, watch chocolate being made 
And then of course they have a gift shop where you can sample and purchase all of your favorites at the end of the tour. But be sure to walk through the cactus garden because it really is on a small level, very interesting. And you can teach your kids all about the native plants as well. Okay, pop quiz to see who is paying attention. Which athlete is the Olympic gold medalist that practices at the Whitney Mesa BMX track in Henderson? Is it Corey Hart, Connor Fields, Jimmy Garoppolo, or Marc-Andre Fleury? Let me know in the comments below. I'll give you a shout out on my next video. Number one is Henderson is home to the River Mountain Loop Trail and the Lake Mead Recreational Area. The River Mountain Loop Trail is a 34 mile trail where people can ride bikes or hike and it surrounds the River Mountain and connects the Lake Mead Recreational Area, Hoover Dam, Henderson, Boulder City, and Las Vegas. This trail to me is particularly beautiful in the spring and the fall. The summer is rather warm, so I don't like to go out there because it's very exposed, but it is a really pretty place to just take in the Mojave Desert, and you can see all kinds of wildlife out there, sometimes bighorn sheep, there are coyotes, lots of different bird species out there that you don't see in the city. It's just a really nice, peaceful and serene place that's not far from the city at all, especially if you're living in Henderson. And then of course, we also have the Lake Mead Recreational Area where people can do all sorts of water activities like boating, jet skiing, water skiing. There's also a dinner boat cruise out there as well that I know a lot of people like to go out and take advantage of on the cooler nights. Well, that is just icing on the cake. Henderson has so much to offer its residents. And if you are seriously considering moving to Henderson, please reach out to me because my passion is partnering with people to find you your dream home. My contact information is in the description below. And for more videos like this, make sure to click on one of the cards around me on the screen. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the bell so you get notified each time I drop a new video. I'll see you next week.